Now, we have some dramatic video to share with you now. This is exclusive video to CP24 that was provided to us by our viewer, Ryan Denis. This is taken at around 6.45 tonight from the 45th floor balcony of his condominium. Dramatic pictures, confrontations between police there that you can see in their yellow sweaters, bicycles being thrown at police, their own bicycles, public safety officers going into the crowd. This was all very unexpected. protesters shut down both lanes of a downtown Toronto highway Sunday evening. Both eastbound and westbound lanes of the Gardner Expressway were completely blocked as hundreds of people marched up the ramps onto the elevated highway. Traffic backed up in both directions of the busy artery for kilometers in both directions. I mean, who is the, the genius who says, block major highways in the largest city in Canada and then wonder why people have no more sympathy for you? You know what happened, I'm sure. This is Toronto. I know there are Toronto bashers out there, but come on. The biggest city in this country on a weekend evening, all the major roads closed down. A couple of thousand Tamil protesters, including, shame on them, mothers with children and med, men hiding behind them. Now, this is what should have happened. Uh, it's called policing. The police go up to them and say, this is illegal, it's criminal, it's wrong, it's dangerous, it's immoral, you're going to be moved, you have 15 seconds, you don't move, we take you away. Children's age should have been there, the men, if they resist, arrested, the women, if they resist, arrested, the children taken away to be cared for in custody until those parents can prove they are actually fit people to take care of the children. This would have happened with any other community, would it not? I mean, couldn't you imagine if uh, Fathers for Justice had done this? We want our kids back, they would have been beaten off the street, for goodness sake. Dear. But the chief of police? Are you a politician or a police officer? The mayor of Toronto, what are you playing at? Are you so terrified of the 250,000 Tamil voters in the city of Toronto? This protest should never have been allowed, never have been tolerated. It's a disgrace and a shame to Canada, its police, its politicians, and most of all to the Tamil population of this country.